Joe Biden's mom snubbed the Queen in the most unbelievable way. She slept on the floor instead of her bed. Joe Biden's mother, who was very proud of her Irish roots, disliked England so much that she refused to sleep on a bed that the Queen had once used. Jean Biden, also known as Catherine Finnegan, and other relatives on the president's mother's side often expressed their Irish identity, something that Biden himself has frequently mentioned over the years. However, Mrs. Biden also harbored some bitterness toward the English, and she did not hide her feelings about England and the royal family. The president recalled that his mother once rejected a bed at a hotel because she found out it had been used by Queen Elizabeth II before. In her biography of Biden, author Georgia Pritchett wrote that the president once admitted Jean hated the English and had composed several poems about it. He searched for the poems and came back with hundreds of verses that called for God to punish the English and pour blood on their heads, Pritchett added. When he was still a senator in 1982, his mother also made him promise he would not bow to the Queen before meeting her. Biden said in a speech in 2013, that his mother gave him clear instructions before entering the meeting, Joey, be polite, but do not kiss her ring. God forbid. Swear. When I told my mother I was going to have an audience with the Queen of England, the first thing she said was, don't you bow down to her, he wrote in his memoirs promises to keep. Remember Joey, you're a Biden, she would say dot you are better than no one. No one is better than you, but you are better than everyone else. And when he met the Queen again for the first time since becoming president in June 2021, Biden seemed to keep his word to his mother by not bowing to her. Biden acknowledged during his visit that the late Queen reminded him of his mother despite Jean's stance on the royal family. I don't think the Queen would be offended, he continued, but she looked like my mother and was very generous with us. She shared her wisdom and made us laugh with her humor. He also paid tribute to Elizabeth II last year when she passed away, calling her a source of comfort and pride for generations. He said that Queen Elizabeth II strengthened the foundational alliance between the United Kingdom and the United States. She was a leader of unparalleled dignity and loyalty. She contributed to the uniqueness of our bond. We had our first encounter with the Queen in 1982, when I was on a Senate delegation trip to the UK. When we travelled to another country for the first time as President and First Lady in June 2021, she welcomed us warmly and impressed us with her generosity, humour, and wisdom. Remember to subscribe to British Royal Daily Updates YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell, this way you will be notified when we drop a video, stay safe.